Hey, Collector. Hey. A love message going on here. Keep an open mind. I split the deck on and give your relationship a chance. Some of you may be feeling like you know you're ready to close yourself off completely because you haven't found true love. You haven't found someone that you can connect with, someone that you can build and grow with, someone that you can learn with. But there might be also someone coming in or trying to return from your past is what I'm hearing, what I'm seeing. Someone who may... Um, you may have thought that this person was your soulmate, your divine counterpart, someone that you could grow old with, build a legacy with, raise kids together, have a home, you know, just the, the fairy tale life that we sometimes um, want to portray. And this is um, man or woman. Because men, you have that desire just as well. Have a nice home, a couple of nice cars in the garage, kids taken care of, wife looking good, booty sitting booty delicious. You know what I'm saying? That coochie good too, you know what I mean? So, yeah. So, we got reconciliation here. So, like I said, it could be something that is coming back in and they want you to trust them because they know that you don't trust them anymore and they want you to trust them they want you to trust that they you know have reached a level of maturity they have reached a level of chivalry i'm hearing just as well you know and they want to continue this journey with you they know that there were times in the past where you guys were not on the same level you know i may have had my back towards you and you may have had your back towards me but here we are and here I am now we are facing each other and I want to love you. I want to give you all of me. I may have been scared in the past because I just didn't trust love for me. I didn't have enough love within myself to love me. But now that I've grown and I've matured and life has taught me many lessons. Here I am. I want to stand in front of you and propose my love to you. Propose my honor to you. Propose my loyalty to you. I want to build a legacy with you. And I truly believe that your spirit spirit baby is working behind the scenes on this and I believe that you a spirit baby for someone is ready to be born she's tired of waiting she misses her parents she misses you and she's ready she's ready to be born give me more Holy Spirit yep let go of control issues what I say it's just it just has come to the point to where we're gonna have to stop looking through the matrix we're gonna have to stop looking through the matrix and understand that everybody is on a journey everybody is on a path everybody is on a mission everyone has their own something we're not going to find anyone perfect. You're not perfect. So why would you want to expect to have the next person perfect? And you know that you're not perfect. Some of you could be, um, all be, it could be your baby daddy trying to come back. New love. There also could be new love coming in. For some, a lot of you, I just heard there is a lot of you who a new person, you have stirred up the romantic feelings of a new person. You have sparked something in a person who may don't who don't have children and would love a fleet of them. I'm hearing and I'm here because I have the money to take care of. Them. I have the land to take care of. Them. I have the legacy. I have the loyalty and I have the love to take care of them. That is just exactly what I'm hearing. Whoever I'm channeling. And back to you. A lot of y'all, this could be your kid's father coming back into the situation. Someone who did love you and you love them. But there may have been a break in communication somewhere. A break in the path where y'all had needed to begin to love each other. True love was on the bottom of the deck. Yes, y'all, that was your true love. 
you know, and the kids may have, have gotten older now, you know, but he's never stopped loving you. He's never stopped honoring you. He's never stopped looking at you as the one he is to be with. Let's get some more cards. Bye. All right, Holy Spirit. Let's get some cards, honey. Two of Wands with the deck of the Two of Wands. Yeah. I'm here. I got love on oh, my mind. Somebody trying to love on you, girl. World card. Somebody trying to change. Somebody, somebody has changed. Your baby daddy, whoever I'm speaking to, five, five, five was just on the clock. Whoever I'm speaking to, your baby daddy has changed, girl. And the lovers, the lovers with the world, y'all. Can y'all see that? Lovers, world, lovers, world. That's a song, ain't it? That's how they sing. Yep. Whoever this is. I'm telling you. Ooh. Ace of Wands. There you go. Somebody is ready to experience a new a new way of living with you. A new way of being. Somebody truly understands who you are. Yep. With this reconciliation, he... Whoever this is, he's ready to come towards you. He is somebody, baby daddy. I'm just here to let you know. Yeah. With the moon. Yeah. This somebody, yo, whoever I'm talking to, this your baby daddy. Or your ex-husband. Could be baby daddy, ex-husband. Whatever it is, y'all have children together. Then there's another group of you guys. There is new love coming into um your situation just as well you're not you're and you need to have trust that this situation is going to bring about the life that you want to live even though this man's aesthetics i'm hearing may not be appealing from the eye you need to use your intuition in this moment but with um with you and the, this baby daddy he, he knew that back in the day he caused you much pain, much illusion, had you on high emotions. Y'all were back and forth with each other like night and day, honey. But he really wants you to trust him. He really wants you to know that he has changed when he come in. And I'm telling you to trust this situation when he comes in with this new offer of love. Yeah. And just as well as for you guys with the new love. Okay to the eye is what i heard went to the eye aesthetically this man may not look like he got something going on okay but when i tell you he gonna be the richest man in the land he gonna be the richest man in the land baby the richest man in the land and he gonna give you a hope for a future baby he gonna give you a hope for a future baby he gonna love everything about you baby he gonna love that you smart huh he gonna love that you independent baby but most of all he gonna love that you love you you hear me he gonna love that you love you because the more you love you he know that you are gonna love him even the more and that is the most beautiful part y'all gonna have the best of sex honey he gonna take you on any trip that you want to be and aesthetically you i'm telling y'all something that is what i'm here do not deny who is about to come into your life because aesthetically he doesn't look like your type but baby he's gonna be the richest man in the land the richest man in the land that's definitely what i'm hearing give me another car holy spirit give me a car this money energy because yeah yep so this nine of ones that's your baby daddy girl i'm trying to tell you all you want to do is come in here Listen, girl, your baby daddy, he ready. He ready to resolve these challenges that y'all have had in the past. He ready to he ready to get back together. He is. Um, that's too many hearts, right? He ready to get back together. And I'm just telling you, give this love a chance. Yep. Be, you know, be kind to him. Allow him to romance you again. We got the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Wands and the King of Cups. You get what I'm saying? We got the Queen of Wands. I spit the deck on the Queen of Wands 
and the king of wands. No, my God. No, I didn't. I spit the deck on the queen of cups and the king of wands. Okay? Both affectionate people. Both romantic people. Both compassionate people. You know? And y'all both miss each other. The kids could be a little older now, y'all. So that means y'all may have been separated for a while. But it's time to give this love another chance is what I'm hearing, honey. I am not lying. Lovers is what popped out. And it popped out right over here under the Ace of Wands and the Moon card. You hear me? This man has truly matured. You hear me? He has truly matured. And he really, really, really has a mutual love, affection, an attraction to you that will not go away. You get what I'm saying? Y'all may have left on bad terms. And like I said, the kids are older now. And there could have been some hard times and some struggles. But it's time for you and this man to come back together. Girl, there it goes. The Six of Cups. What did I tell y'all? There it is. Time for you and this man. The lovers with the Six of Cups. It's time for you and your baby daddy or your ex-husband to get back together. Yup. That is definitely what I'm hearing. Wow. Ain't that something? That's that's beautiful energy. That is the most beautiful energy. I mean, it's just beautiful. Hangman, yep. He has finally moved on. He has finally, when I say moved on, he has finally learned to control his emotions. He has finally learned to step into his divinity as a man, as a father, and as a husband. He now knows what it what it's like. He now knows that. He knows what it's like not to have you, to be away from you, and to truly know that he had an angel within you. And his money could be getting better. He may have had a change in career. You know. A raise on his job. And he wants to. He, he just ready to celebrate this new life with you. Because that could be a big part of why y'all broke up. Finances. Finances is like the number one reason for divorce. I ain't even get on that. Give me a card on this new love. This is what how I feel y'all finna get married. This new love, this man for this new love, you about to be married, boo. But this is what I'm hearing. Shawty, I'm only gonna tell you this once. You're the illness. The dump the dump dump dump. <laughs> you know that Nicki Minaj song. That's what I was hearing right as this hierophant popped out. Whoever this is, he is ready to join forces with you, baby. You have sparked something in this man, some type of romantic feeling. This man don't got no kids, whoever this is. And he feel like he can have this life with you. He feel like he can have an abundant, a fruitful life, a, a, a life full of milk and honey with you and kids. He, he just know that you are who he wants to be with. Whoever this man is, he ready to marry you off top of him. I'm not going to lie. I'm not quick to be like, oh, no, slow down. Get to know him, motherfucker. But listen, the, the rate we going, it ain't too many men love. Okay? Ladies. So, if I was you, I'd go ahead and jump on it. I sure would. Give me a card on this hyphen energy. Holy Spirit, please and thank you. Yeah. Ooh, temperance. There it goes. I'm telling you something. Whoever this man is, this new love, because we done with the baby daddy. We're not going to talk about baby daddy no more. We over here talking about new love. Okay, before the camera shut out. This new love, this man is very patient. He's very peaceful. He may own his own business. He does not have an ego. He, um, he loves to heal. He does not love rifts in relationship. He loves communication. Uh, he's very patient and slow to anger. And he just feel like you would just be the perfect wife for him. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. 
he wants to pour into you and that is in a lot of ways <laughs> Take that. I'm sorry. I'm not even going to get on it. Ooh, Lord. Give me a card on this temperance, Holy Spirit. With this new love. What we got to do with this new love? 15, 15 on the clock when I just said new love, honey. What we got to do with this new love? What we got here? Okay, we got the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah. And it came out in reverse. You know, and... Usually the nine of pentacles is a woman that is uncontent without a partner. But with this temperance here, I am definitely feeling like you are tired of being without a partner. Like your patience has run fucking thin. You are damn near ready for somebody to get on their knee and say, will you marry me? With this hierophant here just as well. And say, will you marry me? You are ready. You know, yeah, I'm content, but I ain't. She, I need some help around this mother of it. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just <laughs> oh, that's funny. Yeah. Yep, that's what it is. Like, you've been patient enough. You, you waited long enough, you know. And it's time for a commitment to come in. It's time for someone to see your value. It's time for someone to step up to the motherfucking back. You hear me? Step up to that bed and make that motherfucking home run. You hear me? Hit that bitch out the park. You feel me? Shit, I'm tired of waiting. I know I'm fine. I know I'm talented. I know I'm successful. You hear me? But baby, I'm ready for a partner to come in and help me carry this load that sometimes I feel like it's a little too hard for myself. You know, I want that counterpart. I want somebody to hold me at nighttime. I want somebody to hug me. I want somebody to look me in my eyes and tell me that they love me. Yeah, that's why it's in reverse with the temperance because you're ready. You're just ready for a commitment. Not because you're not content. You're ready for a commitment. One more card, Holy Spirit. Let me know something. Smart, independent. That's the Queen of Swords. Mm -mm -mm. Well, I guess we ain't got nothing else, do we? Yeah. Yeah. You tired of feeling rejected. You tired of feeling lonely. You tired of you know going through the same bullshit when it comes to men when it comes to the different relationships that you or women when it comes to the different relationships that you run into there's about to be a new love and he ain't about to cause you none of that regret and anxiety the, the feeling rejected undervalued he is going to understand exactly who he already knows who you are he already understands your value as i'm saying this he knows exactly who you are 1818 on the clock He understands your value he understands and he is ready he, he is ready to balance the scales out in your life he's ready to help you when you need help he's ready to just be your superman he's ready to be your knight in shining armor 